If you guys would like to win this free iPhone 7, all you guys have to do is follow these simple rules. All you guys have to do is subscribe to the channel, turn on channel notifications, leave a like on the video, and then comment down below saying you subscribed and you'll be entered to win at the end of the month. Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy District Training here bringing you guys this brand new video. Now today guys, we're going to be talking about the real meaning of Bodak Yellow by Cardi B. Now before I get into the video, I just want to let you guys know you guys should really watch this video all the way through because there's some very interesting things I bet you didn't even know about of this song. I also got to give the notification shout out of the video. That's going to my boy Reese. Shout out to you man. Thank you so much for being active on the channel, just everything in general and being a really nice guy. So if you guys would like a notification shout out starting my next video, all you guys have to do is go subscribe to Reese that's the number one step his links gonna be in the description below make sure you guys subscribe to me Ch turn on channel notifications leave a like on the video and then comment down below saying you subscribed or notification squad I will be checking his channel to make sure you guys follow the first step now we're gonna jump right into this video because it actually is pretty interesting after I did some research on the song Bodak Yellow by Cardi B now I bet a lot of people actually didn't even know this either so if you guys can leave a quick early like on this video that'd be much appreciated but anyways guys, Bodak Yellow is Cardi B's shout out to the rapper Kodak Black. Now if you guys don't know who Kodak Black is, which is very unlikely because he's one of the most known artists of 2017 so far. He's just another rapper and he makes really great music as well. Now in the video she explains that she titled her new track Bodak Yellow because it has the same flow as Kodak Black's song No Flockin'. No Flockin' was one of Kodak Black's first songs to ever blow up and gain traction to build his name up which is absolutely awesome. I really enjoy and love the song as well. The shout out comes at an interesting time for Kodak Black because the rapper recently proclaimed that he doesn't like dark skinned black women. Now guys the rest of this video is going to get kind of weird but like like this is like these are facts as well like what I'm saying right now is facts it's on every news article it's all it's really weird I didn't even think of this either but this is just kind of what the song actually means Bodak Yellow actually hit the number one spot on Billboard Hot 100 list which is absolutely awesome so if you are watching this video somehow Cardi B congratulations now there is rumors going around that Cardi B actually regrets naming her track Bodak Yellow because it, she doesn't really like what Kodak Black was saying about the song. But the thing is most of Kodak's fans are dark skinned black women yet he has the nerve to say that he isn't attracted to them and it kind of hit Cardi B in a wrong way. Cardi B actually said in an interview, I used to wonder why he was unable to stay out of trouble but now that I see that he needs help seriously. Now honestly it's not really that big of a deal to me like every guy if you are a guy watching this you already know you have like a certain type you like it's not really that big of a deal but it is kind of messed up to say like a racial part that he doesn't like you know a certain color. Now if you listen to the song No Flocking and Bodak Yellow back to back you would notice the very very similar flows and that's because she actually made the song with Kodak Black's song in her head. Now it's practically the exact same flow of as Kodak Black and it, a lot of people are saying that she kind of put Kodak Kodak Black into the dirt. Kodak Black hasn't had a hit song like this in a like um, actually I don't think he's ever had a really hit song like this but then Cardi B can come out of nowhere and make a song basically with his name in the title and absolutely blow up. Now I don't really have a good opinion on this because in my opinion Kodak Black makes really good music like he makes a lot of good tracks but maybe they don't you know get as much traction as this song did but this is only one song by Cardi B and Kodak Black has tons of other really hit songs so let me know what you guys think about that down in the comments below. If you guys would listen to No Flocking and Bodak Yellow, it's Cardi B's warning to the haters. In both songs, basically Kodak Black and Cardi B just talk about how they're on the come up and they're not gonna stop for anybody. Now in both songs, the lyrics are very clear that they're like, they don't wanna be the type of person you wanna mess around with. And it also in both videos, it also shows that both people are about the gang life and they don't really wanna mess with people that aren't motivated. So let me know what you guys think about this song down in the comments below. Is she gonna be a one-hit wonder is all of our next song is gonna be trash honestly I have no idea this is the this is actually the first time I've ever heard of Cardi B now this is by no means a hate video towards Cardi B or Kodak Black I'm actually a really big fan of both their music they both make really good music but this is kind of getting a little cocky for Cardi B because this is her first really really hit single and she was already talking about dethroning Taylor Swift and that's a little bit of a far stretch now almost every single song that Taylor Swift puts out is going on the top 10 billboard hot 100 list and this is the first time cardi b has been on it so she better hope her next song is another hit 
Now, I'm not going to lie, if she makes more music like Bodak Yellow, obviously everybody's going to like it because that was a very good song. But Taylor Swift puts out constant good music that everybody enjoys and loves. So just to sum it all up, basically, Kodak Black and Cardi B, they're actually pretty good friends now. They did talk it out and everything, so everything is good with the song and the song title. But Cardi B did have a little bit of a problem with what Kodak Black after what he said, but it could be because Kodak Black was kind of pressured into the moment because the song was blowing up and his name is practically the title of the song. The song also copied the same style and flow as his really hit song No Flocking as well. So basically Kodak Black had every single right to, you know, be pressured, but what he did say was kind of wrong. Now this is by no means, as I said, a hate video towards him. I am a really big fan of Kodak, but that was kind of a bad thing to say. So let me know what you guys think down below in the comments about this whole situation honestly we should just all drop it it's not really that big of a deal the song will probably start to die out within the next month or two but still that is a very good song that cardi b made that has been the video guys i hope you guys did enjoy if you guys would like to go follow me on twitter my twitter is on the screen right now i provide youtube help if so if you guys would like any sort of youtube help you guys can go hit me up on there i do provide a service if you guys would like to be interested in that to help you grow your youtube channel anyways guys it's been district training if you enjoyed the video please hit a like on this video that would mean the absolute world to me peace out